So this is part five of the Omni Wall setup video. So let's go over what I've done and what I'm gonna do today. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Warwick and you're watching Gas Tax. Here on Gas Tax, I'm trying to help you get your garage organized. So this is part five of the Omni Wall setup video. So let's go over what I've done and what I'm gonna do today. Firstly, what I did is I ordered the XL Weekend Warrior package. Um, and that was in order to get a base of a, a foundation of what I actually had to work with. And from there, I figured out how I wanted it all to be laid out in my garage and placed a second order for some additional parts. So the first organization I set up was this one. This is my cabinet set to maintain my house right here. So these are just gener generic tools that I need to maintain my house. These are some of the parts I have left over and some more over here. Another video covers this organization right here. These are all my power tools. Clearly I'm a DeWalt fan and that is organized on the side of my cabinet. So if you wanna see how that's done, go check that out. The latest video was organizing this backdrop of my cabinets here. There's two ways to do your sockets. There's these magnetic um, socket holders and even inside here they're magnetic to hold the socket from falling or you take those magnetic socket holders and you put them on this bracket. I have the blue bracket, I just wanna test out to see which one option is better for me right now. And now today is I'm gonna put a panel there and a panel there, removing those shelves so I can have more options for organization. So, let's get hanging. Well, there you have the install guys one and two panels there um i highly recommend you get that laser level i've been using i've mentioned it many times link is in the description below uh, especially if you're doing a home project um, then it's definitely worth the value if you're just going to buy it and have it around i think it's worth the value but it is i think 90 bucks or something um all right so now to organize so the main thing i want on these two is firstly all the electronics my amazon here um i do film everything in the garage so i need a place to put my charges and then as crazy it does as it does sound i do have a bunch of sets of drills and impacts i have a dirty set which i want to keep here um for when i'm working on dirty things i hate dirty tools this is actually roofing tar so it's not coming off easy so i'll put all my dirty ones i only have a, an impact driver and a drill that are dirty they will stay here for when i have to do dirty dirty work there so i have all of these i'll definitely be using that um i don't think i'll be using the shelves maybe i will some hooks uh this tray what i did do is i ordered the bottle openers this one came with the weekend warrior but I ordered them in different colors, you know, cause they need to stand out <laughs> when you're using them. So let's get to organizing those areas. here we go two shelves organized let's check them out so what I have here is obviously my camera charging stuff right down here first aid kit everyone needs a first aid kit in the garage uh, fire extinguisher and then as I mentioned these will be the dirty uh, drivers uh, and then a charging station up here I have another charge and a couple more batteries I'll, I'll throw up there then extra camera suction cup mounts pens obviously a bottle opener and then the must have zip ties. Moving over to this side, um, got my tire uh, pressure or tire pump, my drone, uh, my lights, 
charging station for the lights. This is just a clip on shelf here that you can slide things on. My propane, my hand wipes, and then an extra thing for pliers. Um, all of these can be, they will be secured if you can see there's a hole um, with plastic clips that come included. But I want to see how this goes for a month. And then if everything's in a good spot, then I'll start clipping them on. Let's look at the extra stock I have. So these are phone mounts. I thought I'd need one. I ordered an extra one and then I, it came with one. All these, I don't necessarily like using these, um, but I ordered them, they were super cheap. Extra bottle opener, this huge thing for screwdrivers. Um, all the clips, an extra mount obviously the socket holder and then four more shelves uh, what I will end up doing is probably put uh, another set of OmniWall uh, panels in my utility room upstairs in my house because you know lots of times my wife wants something hung or a picture hung or something and I don't want to walk down here to get everything so I will probably do that, put a nice little tool set in there with an extra drill and stuff. Um, just so I can utilize some of the stuff and the panels are relatively cheap. That is it. To me, this is the least impressive organization. I may play with that. To me, this is the, one of the best ways you can use this system. And then this is also a great way to use the system. This just gives me a versatility when it comes to organization and change over time because what I had there were just those metal shelves and they were stagnant if you will if you know what I'm saying this way at least if I'm working on a project car my requirements over there will be different if I'm working if this garage just, just turns into a garage because I have no projects then the requirements will be different so it's nice to have the versatility there so thanks a lot for tuning in if you have any questions please feel free to leave them below um please hit that thumbs up button and the like button and if you're thinking about getting some omni walls there is a code down below a link below where you can get 20 dollars off your omni wall set until next time i'll see you there